educate students on information, making sure that they acquire adequate knowledge in their chosen fields of academic endeavor. Almost 95% of my students will fail this year. You see, the greatness of a man is not measured by his material wealth. No. But by the question of integrity, honesty, his ability to affect the world around him positively. Unfortunately, the lines have become blurred as to what is, what isn't permitted by you professors of this university. And in case you have forgotten who you are, may I remind you that you are supposed to be the epitome of integrity, the paradigm of honesty. So, you are very sorry, sir. You are sorry. Yes. In fact, you are very sorry. What a shame. Shame! Need I remind you of your calling? I mean, the, the, the basic tenets of your calling as lecturers of this institution. Is to educate students on, on, on information and the use of it. You know, making sure that students get adequate skills and knowledge, particularly in, in their basic uh, fields of academic endeavor. No, no, sir. No, sir. No, sir. I, 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 I don't need to. Even you, Professor Joe. You see, the greatness of a man is not measured by the amount of material wealth at his disposal, but by the quotient of integrity and ability he possesses to affect the world around him. That's what makes a man. Uh, but it, since it appears you both have uh, sold your integrity in exchange for ephemeral pleasure in the loins of children given to you as words, I am left with no option than to have you suspended. Ah! One, 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 one more word from those dirty mouths of yours, and we make it a sack. Dismissal.